uh, doing neato things in Linux, I just wanted to tell you about my computer that I have, Acer, it's an Acer laptop, it's an Acer Spin 3. I've done a review on this before. And I've gone through different steps to get the touchscreen to work on this. This is a touchscreen computer. Now, the touchscreen uh, in a lot of Linux distros is that it hits the right click when you touch the screen and like, well, it will highlight things and won't do your, uh, it won't do the left click. What my son has discovered with Chrome and Chromium based uh, web browsers, when you're using your finger to, for, for that, it actually works the way it's supposed to. You have a right click and it has a touch and tap so you can scroll up and down with your content. You can be on Facebook or whatever and, and do that. If you want to touch the screen while you're on the internet. So the same thing will work with Chromium. Works the same way. It's like a right a tap to click on uh, on where you're, where you're going to. So that's uh, with Chromium and with uh, Chrome. Firefox, this doesn't work. With Firefox, it just does that. It simply highlights the text. So I don't know if there's, if someone can answer this for me is maybe, is there an add-on or an extension that will make that work in, in Firefox? If not, it doesn't matter. I have done some research on how to turn off the touch screen, uh, that's what I've had a lot of people say. Well, actually, I got this laptop, but I just don't want the touch screen to work. Um, my kids come up to it and touch on the screen and all that, and I can totally understand that. Um, there is a way of doing that, but it's command line based, and you gotta be make you gotta make sure that you don't type in the wrong um, input uh, because it will cause your uh, your uh, it will, will cause it to not work. So, like for example, you can actually just de de deactivate the touchpad. Now, in this version of Linux Mint, it doesn't have. You can't go into the settings and set it up how you want your uh, touch screen to behave. It gives you an option how, on how to use the touchpad and mouse, but it doesn't give you an option for the for the uh, touch screen. There's also a program that I've done a review on before called Touch Egg. Now, I don't use Touch Egg a lot. I really don't care for the touch screen, honestly. It just doesn't appeal to me. I'm old school. I like using, I'd rather use a mouse more than a touchpad, but a lot of the time when I'm using this computer, I'm using the touchpad. Especially with these laptops here that can uh, fold into a tablet. But. Now, with the Windows version of this, it will turn into, it will turn uh, uh, the other way for you. This version here won't. I don't know, maybe if I make it full screen, I, it will. No, just sort of stays uh, sideways. 